Jared and Jacob have found a mark. I, I mean, they found a possible couple of converts to the Latter day Saints Church. And they've gone inside, started talking to them, and Roger said he wanted to check on some religious censorship. Yeah, excuse me, I'm just uh, going through my imagery. It's not necessarily uh, topical. It's what I designed last month. Anyway, back to Roger and uh, Rita. Roger. Makes that call. He checks and posts and five four two four two two nine four one four zero. I've been asking for World Trade Center flight ninety three checks for over seven years. I'm John Melton Brady. He explains that that's who he's calling as his wife, Rita. Makes a video of terrorism in America, hijacking America's lifelines. Rita makes a video with her phone as Roger calls John Melton Brady. Tries to. 424-229-414 explains who he's calling, why he's calling. He's calling to check America's lifeline for religious, political, all other kinds of censorship. And he doesn't reach me. And read the post to YouTube. In numbers, uh, hopefully lots of readers out there this 4th of July, every day. We'll be posting in numbers too high for those terrorists hiding in our shadows. Nice folks. Hiding behind religions, hiding behind political correct, hiding behind families, handicapped folks, all kinds of things. Numbers too high for those nice folks. Well, Lori's as I call them. Too high jack. He does that, and then after they're done making the uh, the post, Roger asks Jared and Jacob, those two missionaries who invaded their home, interrupted their dinner. He says, I've heard John Milton Brady say that the L.A. Library did not like his religious expression, his imagery. They said a man in a uniform, a policeman with a library, said he did not like a three-inch pen on the cap and called it a sign. And Roger says, I know a lot of uh, Mormons, Latter-day Sinners, uh, work in libraries, the whole genealogy thing, the whole library thing. Do you use your influence, do you use your job to conduct religious censorship within libraries across America and across the world? Is that religious censorship I just demonstrated that's endangering the welfare of America? And he gets a Jared and Jacob's reaction to that for another uh, post to their YouTube. Do they, guys? All soldiers in all military bases, you call me. You protect America as part of it at 424-229-4140. Answer that question right there. Is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? Did you can reach me by phone? Oh, man, he's not. You can't. We got a common thief. We got a terrorist in our White House. We need to get the truth out so we don't get another one. Next uh, term. And yet, tell all your friends and family, calling from the mayor, governor, reporters, network, news anchors, local, state, and federal officials. Check and post and slide in front of them. Get their reactions, especially for those running for president, to mayor, to anywhere in between. And oh, yeah, check out vote dash truth.blogspot.com. This 19th. Uh, June 2016, I updated it. It's this Sunday. Got some new imagery, new number. Checking, posting, five. I'm not uh, running for office, guys. I'm just building Jesus' house, despite evil men like, yeah, Barack Hussein Obama. And folks hiding behind religions across our country, across the world. Despite them, I'm building Jesus' house. You guys see me in person to do that? When you see someone other than me, my changing eyes right here on my chest. We have started. Be a part of that. Today.